All right, we're rolling. Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is your boy Razman again with another deck guide um, video. Um, today we're going to be playing a deck which has Obosh. Um, you can remember Obosh when it first came out in Korea and when the companion feature was very, very good. Uh, people just slammed that Obosh. They had the um, artifacts and enchantments to actually boost the creatures. But uh, now we're playing it with Timo Ram. So we have a normal set of Timo Ram here. Um, the usual Edgewell Innkeepers. Uh, the major, major key card of the Timo Ram deck is basically the Genesis Ultimatum. Um, with a ramp deck like this, the whole idea is that you use uh, spells like Cultivate and Beanstalk Giant to bring the uh, lands and we use uh, the Love Trap Beast and a few probably a few other creatures to bring the Henge in turn 4. So from there, we'll use the Terror of the Peaks to just start killing your opponent directly. Um, the whole idea is that when you cast Genesis Ultimatum is to hope that you put in a Terror of the Peaks or two and a few other creatures, you can just directly hit the opponent on the face and win the game. So let's see how this works. Um, um, I'm going to be playing best of one in this, in this video. We got Spike the Houses for some uh, land curve and some uh, one damage. Especially when we get the Obosh, this will be more brutal. Uh, imagine that uh, you get to cast the Obosh and put in the Terror of the Peaks. It will be awesome. Uh, I put in some sideboards here. So it has the usual removal spells, Akron War and Ox of the Agonos. Um, I throw in a Mystical Dispute just for fun. Um, so you have a choice to play either two, but um, it's fun playing the best of one uh, game. Uh, let's see. Um, by the way, if you've still been enjoying your video, uh, the videos I've been making so far, really appreciate it. Um, please do like and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Um, I do stream from Monday to Friday from uh, 9 a.m. Uh, Eastern Time. I'm planning to change the time to 9 p.m. Eastern Time in the near future. So watch out for that change. Uh, and let's see. Uh, till then, we'll see you in the arena. D Reds. Risky hands. Better. Need to yep, draw that again. Still a risky hand. Okay. Probably like a mirror match. Can't be mono green. Probably it's gruel as well. Scavenging Ooze. Okay. I need to blow that away. A mono green. Oh, cruel, definitely. Okay, can do a turn for can do a turn for hinge. Where did they put a land? No, oh, bush fire. Gonna maximize the brush field elemental. They're probably gonna drop a we probably gonna need to block the last trap piece. Or not. Okay, what a gamer. Huh? 
month. Uh, and we're screwed. <laughs> uh, gosh. I'm gonna have to do, do, do this. I would like to find my blue with the cultivate, but. Alright, no, that's fine. Uh, 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 uh. Henge? Unless they have an ember cleave. Not so sure what they are. Drool deck has a hench though. We'll see. We'll see. Yep, put on the land. Can. I'm not gonna blow away the love strap beast. We got like a dragon fire or a, yep or that. Sure, bro. Sure. Boom. <sighs> Finally. First things first. Since they can't attack next turn, I'm gonna maximize the cultivate. We need some more islands. Getting ready for the ultimatum eventually when we draw it. Eventually. Ooze. I'm gonna pump out the ooze for one. What a gamer! Okay, dude. Okay. Ultimatum one time. Ultimatum one time. No. No. Okay. Let's draw a card. Um. Oh, that's fine. That's fine. That's good. It's good for us. Ultimatum one time. Ultimatum one time. Alright, that's fine. A large scavenging ooze. Yep. Five five scavenging ooze. Probably need to block with the heart's desire. Sure. Come on, man. Don't touch my stuff. Leave my brazen borrower alone, please. Sure, bruv. Sure. Yeah, you can slap. Yep. Or oh, you can do that. Doesn't matter. Okay. Scav ultimatum one time? No. Not this time, sir. Alright. How we do this? Definitely gonna reset the scavenging ooze. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, let me let them eat that. Sure. One hench. What we get? Sending back the, the ooze. Gotta restart all over again, sir. Alright. They didn't have an answer. 
Okay, bro. Okay. Okay, one more to diamond. <laughs> This is a keeper, definitely. We'll probably play the forest first, just to let them think. Get them to start thinking. Innkeeper, Monka S. Alright. I want to send it back. Yeah, let's send it back first. So they come in and attack. I think I played this guy before. Alright, fine, I'll take one. Or maybe not. Let them cast that again. Alright. Gonna blow the uh, thing away. Oh, that's fine. So we've got a nice curve here. A nice curve to go for a terror of the peaks. No ultimatums just yet. That's the game winner. That's what we're trying to do after with this kind of deck. For red, yeah, let's set up the terror of the peaks. Uh, gonna slow it down, down, kind of have the eddy lingering around. So now we're kind of like exposed to a scavenging goose that's kind of dangerous. We saw it in the last match, but let's see if we can manage. That's worse. Okay, bruv, okay. You are the gamer. Okay. Don't touch my dragon. Don't touch my dragon. Probably have a primal might. I'm gonna take this four. No, obviously. Okay. Edge worse, worse. Okay, bro. Okay. Let's get rid of the questing bees first. Right, so they're kind of like a bear. Uh, yeah, why not? Just put in more pressure to them. Right. The beauty of the terror of the peaks. Okay. Six six laugh trap beats. Which is fine. We just only need to keep on creatures and um, all that will happen. All that will happen. Come on, ultimatum one time. Ultimatum one time, please. Is it? What a gamer. They have the hench, so they have that advantage. So we're gonna look for a green. Sure. 
Come on, ultimatum. Yes. We got it, chat. We got it. Okay. If we attack, they're probably going to block our rough strap beast anyway. Okay. Holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put any 1-1 one, one opponent. Elephant. 4-4 four, four, Elephant Monka S. Tench okay. man, what a cut. What a cut. Is it? A slam. Uh, Ultimatum. Ugh. All right, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Maximize that. Slam the Obosh next turn. We can. Alright. Alright. Definitely need to block this. Sure, do sure. Easy one, two, three, four. We kind of got this. We can only attack with three creatures. Yep. Yep. Sure. So let's prioritize. Yep. I should do it. Amber Cleef Monka S. Wow. We're just dead, guys. Wow. <laughs> Amber Cleef wins game. So close, so close. If only they didn't draw the Amber Cleef, but oh well. Dropping lands. Dropping turns. I mean, go back to Esperino after this. Asperino. hand. Another risky hand. Probably need to drop the hand. Uh, Genesis ultimatum. Okay. Now, here comes an Asperino gamer. Okay. Red mana wizard. Red. Red color will be nice. Anything red will be nice. Land especially. Land. Alright, that's fine. I'm gonna do this. Yep. Then we can play the blue next turn. Sure. Here comes the Orion. Alright. We kinda got it. Should be like the standard Asperino with the Doom Portal and. Uh, dance on the vents. Nothing just yet, so kind of curious. 
but they have like stuff to put down. Wait, hang on. Pass to attackers. Don't counter my giant opponent. Don't counter my giant. Let's try this. One crusher giant. I'm gonna do the other way around. <laughs> right. Note to self. Edge well in keeper first, then bone crusher giant. That's the whole idea. Rough for the god. Scat to the sky. Yorian. Okay. They're gonna take away the Bone Crusher Giant. Fine. Holy crap, man. Double Glass Casket. Ah. Setting the Brazen Borrower. Come back and cast it back again, right? Sure. Here comes our Bosch. I feel like some heavy heaters there. Wonder what. Strangely, they're keeping their hands. Their... I'm not so sure what they're keeping in their hand there. Obviously. Probably Elspeth Conquers Death. Okay, we've got the key card. We just need one more red. Okay, two, one more blue actually. I have to. Come on, bring in your Elspeth. Okay. Strangely, they have an evolving wild in the Esper deck. Casket there, alright, stay there, stay there. <sighs> Monka S. <laughs> Monka S. Probably have an Elspeth there or something. Let's set up the hench if we are able to cast it. Okay. Critical turn. Okay, here comes the Elspeth. Sure, that's fine, that's fine. We're gonna take that. Okay. Alright, this is something. Still short of mana. <laughs> wow. Alright, don't counter my stuff, opponent. Negate, obviously. Negate main deck on this Esperino Gamer. Alright. We'll put some pressure to them. Of course. Gonna take away the ultimatum. Not an ideal mana curve to cast this. 
happened to me a couple of times. The opponent will have have a better mana curve currently. Ouch. Try anyways. I gonna counter this one. Negate. Nope. Okay. Feels bad. Didn't cast the Obosh. Let's gain life anyways. Bring them to some pressure. Okay. One, one more ultimatum. One more ultimatum wizards. One more ultimatum. We have the curve now. Down to ten. Okay. So, right with the last drop beast. Okay. See if they counter this. Need more reds. i uh, slam the Beanstalk Giant first. Right, if they, let's see if they counter. No counters. 10, 10. Okay. Now we're talking it out. Okay. Probably need to take away the Hench, unfortunately. Or probably we take away the Brazen Borrower. Okay. Game Keeper could be an option to take away. Okay, uh, smart. What a gamer. The Elspeth Nightmare can't take away any of the creatures. Probably we're gonna let go of our Brazen Borrower. They need to somehow take this away. So either they can't attack. But too bad we don't have any enough mana to cast both the Orbosh and the Terror the Pick later, unless we have one untapped land. But let's try it, let's try it anyways. Because we need more red curves. Yep. They're probably hiding something like a dance of the men's or something in their hand, so. They have 5 mana untapped, so what are they thinking about? I'm gonna get rid of the Brazen Borrower because that's... Right, they're skipping the attack. Are they gonna cast anything? No. That's all. Okay. Okay. Let's try this. Counter that opponent. No counters. Boom. Okay. Yep, I think we got it. Not enough mana chat. <laughs> it's all good, it's all good. Uh, you? Yep, we got him. Yep. Couldn't recall the Heartless Desire creature as well. Just one shot of diamond. Death. Uh, 
uh, risky hand as usual. Opponent's going first, so definitely have to send this back slightly better. This is the ideal hand you want to when you want to get. So you're gonna get a blue, green, red curve. Look at that traffic light curve. Almost a traffic light curve. This could be a yellow. So we're gonna need to send back Keeper. All are, all are good cards, unfortunately. Alright, we'll send back the Cultivate. We're gonna ramp with the Beanstalk Giant. Red. Okay, we've got another mana. So oh, that's cool. Leos. Leos. Uh, Heart's Desire. Then we'll follow by an Innkeeper. First Bone Crusher Giant. Probably gonna let them slam their stuff first. Okay, Bone Crusher Giant coming in. Henge. Cool. Gonna slam the uh, last trap piece so it can be a blocker. We've got an innkeeper just to surprise them. So what we do, what we can do is that um, we can miss this because they're gonna blow away the love trap piece, right? You wanna save the, our love trap piece for the hench, ideally, but green? Oh okay. Not ideal. That's fine. Right. That's fine a green one, no? And we'll slam the thing. That's how we surprise them. Are they playing big red? That's the question. Oh, that can happen. Okay, opponent, you are the gamer. What a gamer. So, I'm probably gonna take this. I'm gonna take, take some hits. Are they playing big red? Seems like it. Alright, first things first. Uh, uh. It's all good. Uh, we need more red. got the hench down so we can gain life each turn, two life each turn. Okay, curving all right. Alright. Let's see if they're gonna blow this away. Looks like they got, they got some removal spells for sure. I need one more last shot piece if possible. Draw cards. I want last shot piece, last shot piece one time. All right. It's stabilizing. Sure, man. Sure. Okay. That's fine. More lands. Let's start feeding our beanstalk giant. Shock gamer. Right. An ultimatum next turn would be absolutely fantastic. Is it? So our favor passage is kind of useless now because we draw all our lands already. Got all our basics. Sure. Okay. 
Chandra Hearts. Definitely a big, great gamer. Bye, Lata Beast. Oh, just one way. Feels bad, man. Feels bad. That's something big. Okay. I definitely have enough. Gonna slam the innkeeper. Draw card. Card advantage. Key. Okay. Wow, they got their own terror of the peaks. Mono red terror of the peaks, not bad. How do we do this? We can cycle the trio by it. Just slam a land. One red. Slam the Orbosh. Oh wow, we got him. We got him, chat. Got him. Alright, <laughs> they didn't have an answer. Oh, Bosch is back, chat. Oh, Bosch is back. Alright, that was good. Don't crash on me with it. Don't crash. For a note itself, probably need to. Alright, finally rank up. <laughs> now we can start losing. Now we can start losing. Another risky hand. I'm gonna send this back. Uh, oh my god. No, too risky. Won't take that. Better. Probably playing against a rogue deck. That should be it. Slam that. Soul Mender. Okay. Sure, bro. Sure. Cleric deck, live gain with stuff. Gonna slam the last drop piece first. Then we can slam the hench next turn. Gotta hold the fort. Okay. This is gonna be an issue. Because um, we didn't put any, like, um, the only removal spell we have currently is just the Love Strut Beast. So, gotta be slightly careful. So, I'm gonna slam this and uh, Henge. Unless they somehow get rid of the Love Strut Beast with a. Um, Skyclave apparition, so that's a that's an issue. All right, Luminat aspirin. Okay, that's fine. Ugh. So the cleric can slam for a five now because um, aspirin is gonna pump and Solomander is gonna pump it. Sure, man. They're not gonna attack for some reason. Alright. I know what I'm gonna do. Slam this. No blue mana by the way. Right. Okay. 
Cleric goes to six. No. Nope. Archfiend Vessel. Okay. Holy crap, man. That's a giant. That's a giant life bonder. Probably need to use our heart desire. Alright, heart desire. Saving us. Okay, we're getting a reasonable good curve, but we're kind of mana screwed as, as always. Alright, let's find that blue mana. Blue. Slam it. Return, you can reset your cleric. And set up the Orbosh. Alright. So we can slam the Beanstalk Giant next turn. Barracks coming in. So they're gonna restart everything, which is fine. Angel Pooper in the house. Okay. Sure. Okay. Hmm. Interesting draw. Alright, gonna save the Bone Crusher Giant later. Come on, draw a card. Draw a land, draw a land. Okay, fantastic. Could have been worse. Okay, they're gonna start pooping angels. Here comes Lurus. Oh, there you go. I have an angel. No way, man. Sure. 5-5 five, five flyer. This can put a 5-5 five, five flyer. Okay, what a gamer. Okay. Alright, that's a draw. First things first. I'm gonna blow away the angel pooper. Slam the Orbosh. Slam it. Okay. Nope. I'm gonna start attacking with the thing. So they're gonna slam Lurus, bring back the Angel Pooper. That's high likely the best option. Not going great, but hard game, hard game. That's a hard game. Yep, here comes Lurus. Six six angel. I'm gonna blow away this. That's draw card. Oh wow. Found an angel pooper blocker. Draw a card. Holy crap man. Sure, bro, sure. Right. 
hot game. Hollow Priest, okay, not a scary cut. More angels. They didn't attack for some reason. Um, let's slam this. Send you back. I gotta reset that. Draw cut. Ah, uh, didn't curve that well. Alright, that's nice. Let's find a blue sauce. I'm gonna slam this. gonna do this if we attack this then gonna take away the angel All right let them come let them come okay to win this we need an ultimatum okay sure they got who has the bigger creatures win Alright, that's fine. Uh, more blue sauce, please. Um, I'm really gonna slam this, anyways. Then we can uh, try a cycle for stuff. Ugh. Come on, ultimatum one time. Ultimatum one time. Ultimatum one time. Okay, that's that's a card. That's a card. I'm gonna keep this. Oops. Okay. Right. I'm gonna reset the cleric. We're gonna start putting more angels, but we got the brazen borrower to answer for it. We got two big boys. Yeah. Okay. I got the angel. Yeah. Need one beanstalk giant. Man. They're probably gonna pump one of it. Okay. Not so sure why they pump that one for some reason. Okay. You're gonna reset your cleric, bro. Okay. Fine then. Damn, we are flooded, man. We are flooded. Come on, hench one time, hench one time. Hench one time. <laughs> uh, what? Okay. Might as well gain life. I don't know whether we have land still. Yeah, I got nine lands left. Let's shuffle our card library. Why not? Only one land. Come on. Just need one hench and one ultimatum. One ultimatum. Alright, if I slam this, we got one, two, three, five. 
Um, sorry, wait. One, two, three, seven, eight. Here. Here. Six, six gamer. Is that the attack we're looking for? YOLO, guys, YOLO. I believe in the heart of the cards, we'll draw an ultimatum next turn. There goes an angel. shuffle our cards but it's fine you're gonna need to reset that's the thing right I do have one more brazen borrower though interesting game call of the dead They decided for the Howlot Priest first. Sure. I have an angel! Yeah. Bone Crusher Giant. Still got some left. Yeah, still got two more Bone Crusher Giants, by the way. One. Gonna protect Allurus. Hard game, man. Hard game. Okay. Blocker. Holy crap, man. We are so flooded. Could have attacked. Okay. Second cleric bonder incoming. Alright. Okay. You're only gonna win if there's an ultimatum. Okay. They're reaching like 50 life. Fantastic. Sure, bro, sure. Seven seven demon. Oh my god. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> We're so flooded. Okay. Alright, we're gonna hold the line again. Probably we should have attacked last turn, but oh well. Uh, sure. Second Angel Pooper. Alright. Hard game. Okay, another demon. Okay. More angels. I'll take 9 damage. Why not? It's only 9 damage, right? Okay, finally something. Okay, I need to blow away the Luros. Start with. Come on, Henge. Ultimatum one time. Ultimatum one time. Oh my god. Okay, that is something. Come on. Ultimatum. Ultimatum. Oh my god. Okay, come on. Come on. Come on. Creature cards, please. Creature cards. Creature cards. This is fine. Gonna take this one. Come on. Terror of the peaks. A bit late. But I'll take it. Oh my god. Really, bro? Really? Really? Okay. Who should I blow away? Just slam a tarot at the peaks for fun. I can blow away something. Let's blow away one angel pooper. Come on, more creatures. Yes, yep. I'll probably discard some stuff. Yep. Nope. I'm going to discard the Henge and the Cultivate. Easy. You're so flooded. Oh, what a gamer, man. Top deck, Blood Chiefsters. Just in time. Okay. Ultimatum come a bit too late. Yep. 
sure. Putting in some pressure. So I'll take away you. Okay, 19 damage, easy. Cycle first. All right, that's a cut. Okay. Rather overkill, but I can't afford them to. Us anymore stuff. Um. Oh. <laughs> so lucky, man. All right, I'll take that. I'll take that. Opponent didn't have an answer. All right, diamond one. Sorry, diamond four. <laughs> Alright. Julio's. 